A separate report from the London School of Economics has found the volunteers well, in a real boost. Well, everyone's well fucked, aren't they? To receiving a bonus of my language. pounds Duncan Kennedy, BBC News. France has tightened restrictions on travel from the UK to try to stop the spread of the India variant of coronavirus. New rules came into force at midnight, meaning British tourists will not be allowed in. France is currently listed as an amber destination by the UK government. No one can, um, well, people can actually clear this up, but they just don't want it. They can't. Well, they can, but they can't as well. They can, but they don't want to admit that they can clear it up. Clear what up? Clear up the fact that uh, your children, if you've got them, take them down to the fucking vaccine centre to get spiked up. Go on. Get them spiked up. I don't know, that's what they're doing. Everyone's doing it. Uh, you know, uh, it makes one think. Especially from my point of view, uh, what I did in the first place that no one knows about because it's all been hushed up. Um, mainly by the uh, main narcs and the... Uh, well, the, the remote narcs and the and the ones around me too just fucking did their best and they did it well I've got to say they really fucked the world up really fucked the world right up and what what can I do I think really I do well, yeah. um, am I going to get the V? I'm not sure. I'll try not to, but you know, I might not ever be able to travel again, or uh, even mingle in a in a bar or something, or go out and enjoy myself without being spiked up. A temporary ban on bailiff enforced evictions introduced in England at the start of the coronavirus pandemic comes to an end today. Such a fucking. Do people notice that all this COVID shit has well taken up the uh, main screen? You know, when it used to be about well, you know, aliens and shit like that. I suppose they still got the UFOs and stuff. Um, but, you know, everyone's just chatting about this working. Yeah, and I'm kind of like, well, I'm not blaming anyone really. Despite the emergency financial support that's been available over the past are. year, one and charity um, says widespread concerns remain. We found that a million households are worried about being over working. the coming three months after the When it came to like, Advising or not even trying to dominate people, but just like just informing them to have a look at this because something's going to happen. And it been in the records that I did this as well. I'm not just making this up, yeah? I'm not just making this up right on the spot now. This is, uh, I've been a long time in the making, yeah? And if people don't know that, People do know it. People do know this. What they choose to do with that information is up to them, really. Uh, most people just don't do shit at all. They just uh, would either see me die, yeah? Laugh and then take the piss and then die themselves. Or die themselves and then I die. After. <laughs> it's fucked up. Really fucked up. Because it could have been sorted out, see? If anyone uh, could be less stressed about this situation that they don't know of. 
that I kind of warn them about. Corona. <laughs> Long before the uh, it actually came on the news. Corona information. And uh, it, of course, it, I was just targeting the, the narcs across the pond and stuff. And uh, yeah, across the pond and uh, all these weirdos in America that were targeting me. Yeah, them. And uh, uh, some of them from Britain too, all part of the same cult. So it don't matter. Learn the lost summer for festivals, brilliant. Well done, people. Well done. And, <laughs> and when I say well done, I'm I'm taking the piss. In fact, I mean, not well done. Because that ain't good at all. Uh, don't get me wrong when I say well done. I'm taking the fucking piss. Because that's all you do. That's what people do, is to take the fucking piss. And I uh, think they're great. I'm not thinking I'm great or anything. I'm not trying to lord it. Just a little bit of uh, advice that could easily be seen, backed up, because I've got the information. And all the evidence that people just choose not to look at and uh, choose their own belief system no matter how flimsy it is doesn't really matter whether they're involved in a religion or not this is how sick and dirty this is this goes right down to a core value to get this people to get this and they protect their core of which is pretty rotten you know so that's what you're gonna get. Nice rotten dig. Spiked right into your arm. And for nothing to happen until the next generation of which these people who've been spiked are gonna be either senile or dead. Nice one people again. Thanks. And people still don't know, or can't. I, they they won't be able to. They won't. They can't. Evidently, can't get there. Just to understand this, and all it is is just this thing from years and years and years ago. Who I caught online, yeah. These people, nasty people, all part of a same group that no one speaks about because they're scared people who do speak about it are scared of other people talking about it because they think that they freaking should talk about it more <laughs> and <laughs> I don't know where I stand in the narkiness of this because fuck you know, I must come across as a proper narc like there but all the narcs have to understand out there yeah that I was being this intense with these people online I seemed to just trigger all the narcs around me didn't I you trigger them unknowingly well kind of I didn't quite expect such a narc onslaught I didn't even know what they were didn't know they were narcs. I just thought they were not very nice people, really, just odd ignorant, you know. Um, but yeah, full on narcs. We even fucking deluded narcs in their own fucking minds. No consideration about anyone else. Any other consideration is fake. Uh, really fake and it can be spotted <laughs> so easily so fucking easily it's ridiculous how easy it can be spotted
and yeah, so nice one, people. Again. <sighs> this is not good. Or well, might be good. I don't know. I've got a funny feeling though, see, about this. I've always had a funny feeling about this, see. Can't help it, for some strange reason. I mean, someone's got to have a funny feeling about this, haven't they? If everyone just, like, accepted it straight away, then okay, yeah, give us the vax and all this, um, everything will be all right. And, uh, <laughs> People forget, don't they? People forget so easily about what it's about. And because it's like dragged on for that long. Mainly because of the narcs, really, in life. And not just the ones around me, but just around some other people too. Obviously other people are trying to speak about this and um, are getting nowhere because of all the narcs around them. The army of narcs that seem to accompany anyone who wants to say something of value and worth and truth get shut down by the fucking narcs around them, don't they? No matter what disguise they come in, little or small, big or massive, it doesn't, doesn't matter. They come in all different shapes and sizes and they're all there just for the purpose, narkability. So I didn't bring this word up, narc, but uh, of course the narcs around me don't understand this because they are not narked enough to notice. Um, but other people do, so. And they w may well be narcs too. I don't care if I'm a narc, see? <laughs> That's what's mad about this. Like I'm saying, I'm a narc, or you, you're a narc, and I'm not that thing. I'm not saying it like that. I'm just saying, this is what's come about. This is what's been like exposed. That these types of people stick up for. So yeah, they kind of like stick up for all this horrific abuse that's been going on worldwide, and they've like kept it in suspension too. That's right, yeah. Kept loads of kids in pain. That's what I said, yeah and loads of other people, whether they be adults or kids, psychologically abused, day in, day out, right under people's noses, right in people's faces. And what do people do? Knock away, just knock away, forget about it. Nothing to do with them, nothing to do with me. Uh, but they don't, understand that when you get that spike in your vein and whatever however they do it when that incision is made you've got to know what you've done 